Morning, welcome back. We're heading out with Brock this morning. Brock's gonna show me how it's done. So, we're both on four each, as opposed to our last video where it was three, four to me. Four, three to me. Yeah, yesterday didn't go to plan. I filmed an awesome intro yesterday, um, but yeah, nothing happened. So, everyone's like, oh, I uploaded the videos of where you don't catch anything. Well, if you guys wanted to watch me stand in the rain and sing Shannon Noel, What About Me? for two hours. Literally all that happened. Oh, and a barracuda followed my lure. But we're heading out this morning. We're gonna do some glide baiting and some pooning for some jacks. We'll see how we go. Brock called me twice already this morning, woke the whole family up, so that was great. You ready? Yep. Where the hell is your turtle's tackle hat? Um, <laughs> I forgot it. <laughs> Last time I give you anything, hey. And we're away. Gee, the current's moving, isn't it? Do you wanna move in a bit closer? Here we go. I'm starting out with the bent minnow in the gold, 130. And Brock's starting out with the G splash. You ready, Brock? You bring them up, I'll slay them. It's probably gonna be a long top water day, to be honest. You reckon? I reckon that'll miss us. Oh, it's going that. Oh, we could get wet. <laughs> it took me like, it took me ages. You reckon? Already got one, like heaps of times I've had fish on already. Oh, did you hear that? Oh, yep, they're coming along. Move back out. Yep, they're coming down. Oh, I got swell. Oh, there they are. Yep. Oh, here they are. There. Trev. Oh. oh, he's going hard. Oh. Did you see him come off the wall? Oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. He's going back. Oh, far out. Oh. Man, he's going. Tighten up a bit on it. Listen to it go, dude. Oh, he's got some size about him. Oh, there he is, dude. Yes, good work, dude. Did you see him come off yeah. the wall? That yeah. was insane. Yeah. That was cool. That's a good trev. It's that's like yeah, that's a good one. 55 yeah. or something. Brock and I seen the trevs like working up and down this concrete wall here. Brock wall. Brock wall. Smoke today. Gee, you went hard. Yeah. Oh, first fish of the morning. Solid as a trev. How's that? He's a good 55, eh, Brock? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Man, he went so hard. Couldn't stop him. He just had to let him run. Unbelievable. On the OSP. Ben Minnow, look at that. Totally destroyed it. That's two good fish this lure's got. It's about time I lose it, I reckon. It's normally all I get. First fish down. I think they'd like. There he goes. Look at the teeth mark in it now. Jacks and Trevs, both smashed it. <laughs> that was just awesome to see the bow wave come out from the wall and then just boom. <laughs> Glad it wasn't a jack, he would have smoked me. <laughs> There's a lot of bait coming through on the sounder along this setch. So we're just gonna, instead of going into the canal that we were gonna go into, we're just gonna work along here.
It is, isn't it? And nothing. That's a bit devastating. I was. That was a good hit. Yeah. Could have been a I reckon it might have been, eh? They followed out, Oh, that's yeah. getting nailed. That was a big tree. Yeah. Did you hear the water movement? See, it seems alive, eh? Yeah. Even if you can normally cast at it, yeah. you can cast it. Swim bait time? Oh, just, yeah, while it was open, I thought I might as well grab it. I just want to start. I've never used this reel before. Like, I have it basically where it's not too tight to wind. Yeah. Yeah. That on. That's right. That's... Oh my god. That's beautiful. That feels really nice. Yeah. Yeah, have a cast. Yeah. How good does it feel? Yeah. This is the first time using the new Tatula 100. My Shimano Scorpion broke, so I picked one of these up. Not even really two days. Cause you're like, I'll get another chance at that. Yeah, but the jacket's like, yeah, these are my favorites. The ones where you can get a level along there. Oh, oh, oh yeah, it's got, oh my goodness. Yeah, see the boil? Yeah. Oh, look at the teeth mark in it, dude. Oh. Swim baiting for Jack. Look at that. We've been swim baiting this morning. Look at the teeth mark in this thing. Oh, my goodness. Show us the whip. There to there. That's not, no. 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 That's Jack. Yeah. Oh. So you see the boil after? Big boil. Yeah. Big boil. That was it from, and the, I heard it creak. Yeah. Just as you were like, then you're like, oh, and I heard the pontoon creak. I was just slow rolling along the back of this pontoon. We couldn't do the front because it has a crab pot on it. So we came around the back and it was right at the back near this pylon. And then this boil just erupted. Same lure as the old flathead. Big flathead. Look at the boil. Oh, did you see the red? It was so fast I thought it was a trap. It looked ready tinged, didn't it? Oh, my heart was just... That it, came it, out it, so fast. That hurt your heart. Like, it just went like... Yeah, because I just drunk a red bull, so it's already going. <laughs> he so come out freaking... Hey? Do you reckon you that on the camera? Oh, not a chance. <laughs> oh, really? Cool. I'll just that go back. Are you freaking <laughs> serious? Yeah, nice. <laughs> Again, that was on. It turned and took it under. Oh. Well, that's a shame, isn't it? Right on that back pylon. I've got one of them. I don't know if it's in my. I don't even know where it is. Oh my god, Tim. Brock just dropped his first jack of the day on the little live target. Show of run. Big copy of Mick Horn, hey? <laughs> so we've started doing some pontoon bashing giving up on swim baiting for the morning. So I'm gonna try this. Alan at Munro's Plastics actually can't keep up with the amount of orders he's got from the last video. So I'm gonna give his plastics a rest for a bit and I've trained over. I'm gonna try out the Western, what is it? Shad 
Shad tees in the five inch. Give it a crack today, see what happens. Brock's already had two hits on the, um, what do you got? Live target, live target herring. That's why I got my drag. Oh, that's pretty tight. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> oh. oh. I think that might have been the edge of the pontoon. <laughs> I don't think there's a 10% chance on every pontoon. No, you don't hit 100 pontoons and get 10 jacks. Get one. Hit 100 you might get one. That's a 1% chance. 10% chance is 10 jacks every 100 pontoons. Did you? Oh, yeah. Just got hit. Grab the tail of it. You had a hit on the front, I had a hit on the back. Same pontoon. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh! Don't break your. We had three hits off this one pontoon and then gun. On the braid. On the braid? Yeah. That sucks. That does. Because we've missed so many fish this morning. I did not expect to hook up along the front there because like we already had the two hits. Yeah. And I was like, oh, we'll be. There just must be a school of them under there. Yeah. Well, you know what? Alan's just gonna have to keep up with the orders because I'm putting on another one. <laughs> okay. Yeah? Wow, that had the potential to go really wrong. That's a flathead. Just <laughs> 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 the hook I'm like, oh no, you're going to be an absolute. First cast with the new with the new lure on the smelt. Literally winding it behind a pontoon. I thought this has the potential. Oh, that's gone. I thought this has the potential to go really wrong if I hook a jack. <laughs> I don't know if the camera saw it. Oh, oh the camera working? Oh. <laughs> Imagine if one of us comes out the window. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're both. Who's got? <laughs> Oh, you could just feel the anticipation, couldn't you? Oh, <laughs> oh this is why I can't fish with you, because now we've just ruined that whole pontoon. Because of you. Yeah, look, I just saw two jacks in a barrel. <laughs> I seen two jacks in a barrel humping. <laughs> I interrupted cats humping this morning. On the way to pick you up, I come around the corner and the headlights hit them and they're like this. <laughs> Two white ones like this. <laughs> no, no joke. What are you doing? <laughs> Get off his pontoon. Do it. Do it. Do it? Oh, don't you just feel like it's going to happen? Oh no, I just free spill straight away and just hope for the best. Well, we're still going and as soon as literally the pontoon before my chest camera turned off and a jack came out, not even on the pressure edge of the pontoon, on the behind. Yeah. Yeah, it was like a weird... Right on its behind. A jack came out. I don't know if you can see that, but there's teeth marks all over the jig head and a few teeth mark in the lure there. <sighs> We've been working hard today and we've missed so many chances. How did he not hook up? Freaking nailed it, didn't he? I wasn't even going to cast there because it was... Um, yeah, the, the, the yeah, it wasn't a good edge and I was just like, oh, there's a bit of mangroves, should be sweet. Um, pretty good so far. Really? There's something sitting in there, look.
You reckon? Yeah, I think so. What do you reckon? Where do you reckon? Okay, so we just finished like the biggest row of pontoons ever. Let's go to a different run. Can we get some this time? Yeah. No bust ups, no missed hook ups. Oh. You can't really get no, much. Oh, oh! Could you not? I didn't mean to do no. that. No! That was not why though. It already dropped it. No, it did. It already dropped it. Yeah. Another hit on this pontoon. Dropped it. Teeth marker just behind that hook. Damn, damn, damn. Oh, good cast, Dennis. Every pontoon. <laughs> Oh, get in there, get in there. Another hit. Oh, again. Freaking again. They're just destroying this and no hookups. Little chode. chode. <laughs> it's wider than it is longer. <laughs> that side, I'll hit this side. Or you just cast across the front and just ruin the whole thing. Oh, oh look. What? Oh. That was a jack. Was it? Yeah. No way. Yeah, dead set. Did you see the boil? Yeah, I saw the boil. Yeah, I came up here, hit the road jack, episode one. Yeah. I came up here, yeah. Didn't catch anything up here, so I, I skipped this part of the video. Did you see that boil? Yeah. Like the same, like, oh, I, oh. Did you see that boil? I don't know what. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, got him. Oh. Woohoo! -ho -ho! Yes! We freaking did it! Face the camera towards us! <laughs> we got one! Dude! How good was that? Oh. Oh. What did you get it on? Munro soft plastic. Every, all day, every day, mate. That just worked. That was, I don't know whether it was the boil of one. You know, we were both going for that spot. Yeah. How dirty are you? Uh, a little bit, yeah. I better get dirty before the battery dies. Yeah. Wow. Yes. And he's gone. We got a jack. Oh, there's no photo for that one. Woo, just flicking in some tight stuff. We've missed so many chances today. So well, that was 10 chances before we got one. 10 or 11 chances. That's crazy. Oh, wow, it opens up. Yeah. Hang on, was that my first skip cast jack? Did you skip cast it? I think I did. That was a footage. Yeah. Oh, nearly fell in. I like having someone else on the boat who can actually, oh! Who can actually, oh! Yeah, a little mower. Oh, what are they? Brim. Massive brim, my big school brim. Was it really? Yeah, I could see him. I didn't see him. Oh. I saw just heads. Oh, yeah, I could see the brim. Oh, dude, that's got hit. Heaps of bait. Oh, heaps of bait. Oh, yep. Oh, flatty. Big flatty, big flatty, big flatty. I'm saying take it. Yeah. I can see my glasses. 
I saw it as well. Yeah. Dude, get the net. Just about here, slide him up. Woo! Nice work. I've seen him take it. He hit that on the real yeah. fast retrieve. I've seen him take it on the phone. Yeah. Just smashed this nice flatty. He is probably the second biggest flatty I've ever caught. Check this big female out. Look at that. That is super cool. We're in the trees, Matt. I'm really hard, can't film when I'm in there. <laughs> so we're gonna get this girl back in. Ah, oh, you right? Check that out. That is a nice big flatty in a tiny little creek. There we go. There she goes back to the water. She hit that thing on the fast retrieve. Yeah. Do you want to just stay in here, change batteries over, yeah, yeah. and then you can just pump it out and then hit the next yeah. pontoons? Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. This is actually my 100th video. Big shout out to everyone who's seen all of them. Some of them are pretty dodgy, so. Uh, thanks everyone, can't believe I've made it this far, but here we go. I'm just actually doing a bit of rigging up at work. I've been throwing the swim boat for literally the last two weeks. Check out the teeth mark from that session. So there's one in that side, and there's the other one over there. So check out the width of that, the fang marks on that jack. That's not even the widest point in its mouth. So I'm calling high 50s into the 60s for that one. That's, a, that's an absolute monster. I actually had the very next day, I went back again and fished a different part and I actually had another one come in. There's another fang mark there, and I'm not sure where the other one was because he didn't get a good purchase on it. I actually watched it come out from the pontoon and smash it like a mid 50s jack. There's the teeth mark in the bottom of it. So I was using the BKKs. Here we go. I was using the BKK hooks. And I mean, they're good hooks, they're strong, but I've just gone with a little bit more sticky hook. So the STX 58 size one. And seeing as they're not a bigger gauge hook, they're like a 20% thinner but stronger hook that owner make. So I'm actually going and chucking some sticky weights on there as well. What are these atomic sticky weights? Just to get the lures working properly. So re rigged a couple of my other ones as well that didn't have hooks on them. So got some Samari Ds, uh, this Realis that I found. Um, so putting all new hooks on a lot of my new lures and stuff. This one I found on a... Um, What's that? Savage gear, mullet or something like that. Found that one on an oyster rack. So going through and re-rigging a lot of my old lures with some new hooks. So I've got one more jack on surface, but I've got some lure challenge videos coming up. So hopefully as the new moon kind of heats the fishing up, we are going to get into some more good videos. But sorry about the wait between vids. There took me so long to count how many pontoons we hit that day. So I probably won't be doing that again. Let me know if you liked it though. But thanks everyone for watching and if you've seen all 100 videos, thanks so much for watching and, and following along. Got so much more to do. But yeah, hopefully guys, we've got some lure challenge vids coming up. So another every colour lure challenge. Uh, every, you guys seem to love that one. So there's another one of them coming up. And also, yeah, got a different lure as well. Another Australian made lure challenge video coming up as well. So thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up and I will see you next episode.